train is moving down a slope of 0.08 so in terms of trigonometric relations we can express a slope in terms of tan theta right so i am writing it as 0.08 sorry it is double zero eight 0.008 with a velocity of 48 km per hour so velocity is given so that is nothing but initial velocity which is 48 km per hour so when I consider here the unit is in terms of kilometer per hour so convert that one into meter per second 48 into 5 divided by 18 you will get 13.33 meters per second so this is initial velocity in terms of meter per second at a certain instant the engineer applies the brakes and produces a total distance when he applies the brakes so what will be the final velocity so it will come to rest right so then the final velocity is going to be zero right so 0 meters per second and produces a total resistance to motion equal to 1 tenth of weight of train. So 1 tenth of weight of train he produces a total resistance. What distance x the train will travel before stopping? So this is the question. This is resistance. Let's see it. So let us consider this is the uh, inclined plane. So on it uh, there is a train like this. Let it be train weight of the train acts vertically downwards right so weight acts vertically downwards here normal reaction perpendicular to surface and will be perpendicular to surface so it is moving downwards that means a frictional force will be in the opposite direction F will be in this direction it is accelerating in this direction in the opposite direction there will be inertia force which is nothing but W by G into A here this is theta so we know that for small values of tan theta tan theta will be equal to sin theta so it is very very small 0 0.008 means which is very very small so it will be equal to sin theta so when we consider here so what are maybe the problem first you need to find acceleration so I am considering uh, sigma fx is equal to 0 this is x this is y along the plane I am considering it as x Okay, you can consider in the direction of acceleration it is positive or otherwise along a conventional method along x direction along it is this direction it is positive in this direction it is positive any method you can apply there so here I am considering the conventional method f along positive x direction and next plus w by g into a along positive x direction And next uh, one more force is uh, F is over frictional force is over ok one more force is uh, weight component I forgot to resolve that so weight can be resolved into two components so if this is theta this is going to be theta then it is W cos theta it is W sin theta minus w sin theta equal to 0 here it is given that it produces a, a total resistance to motion equal to one tenth of weight of train so this resistance when the train is moving this direction the resistance is nothing but frictional force it will be equal to one tenth of weight of train so it is nothing but w by 10 plus w by g into a is equal to w sin theta so take w as common 1 by 10 plus a by g is equal to sin theta so here w w gets cancelled from that a by g is equal to sin theta minus 1 by 10 a is equal to g into sin theta minus 1 by 10 here 
g is equal to 9.81 and sin theta is 0.008 minus 1 by 10 is nothing but 0.1 right so when you solve this one you will get the acceleration value as minus 0.902 meter per second square this is the value of acceleration now I got the value of acceleration and I have the initial velocity final velocity I want to find the displacement so here this is the problem so I got the acceleration so I have the initial velocity which is 13.33 final velocity I have calculated acceleration and displacement I want to calculate so I can use the relation v square minus u square equal to 2 as final velocity is 0 minus 13.33 square is equal to 2 into acceleration I got that one as uh, minus uh, 0.902 right so this is minus 0.902 into displacement as I want to find that so minus minus gets positive from that I can find the value of s when you solve it you will get 98.4 meters which is nothing but the distance the train will travel before stopping thank you for watching hope you like this video if you like this video click on like button and don't forget to subscribe